play too much. What is your body count? Have you ever cheated? And if hand would hang with me by my side. <laughs> what Kayla Nicole do? <laughs> wait, the babe. Wait, wait, the babe. I got tatted, y'all. Video on my channel coming very soon. Yes, it is. You'll see it. If you don't see it, that means you wasn't subscribed and you didn't have your bell hit. And if you miss it, that's on you. Right. I'll be back because I gotta get my chance so I can sit down and answer all these questions. My walkie froggy. Let me go get my questions because they are on a piece of paper that's all the way over there. I did the most I made over here and I didn't even bring a piece of paper with me, so now I gotta get up and go get it. But it is what it is up here. Whew. Now that I'm done being ADHD, what's up, my gems? It's your girl, May the Gem. And I'm back with another month video, y'all. Honestly, I shouldn't even have to bleep the cuss words out over here on this station because if you over here on this station, you for the grown folks. Period. And for all ages, hopefully, sometimes I'll be talking a little bit for grown folks only, but sometimes I don't. And if you want to be honest, we all going to be grown one day, so hey, it is what it is. You're going to be grown longer than you're going to be a kid. So, all right, you guys. So, y'all see that title. Y'all see it's me. I'm here. I'm lit. I got a few spicy questions for us Q&A that I didn't answer some of these questions. But I've been getting these questions a lot, and I just wanted to figure out that I was just going to go ahead and answer them. Because, I mean, y'all want to know, so I'm going to tell y'all. So, if you this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that bell. And also, you guys, down in the description box, I'm going to have a link to a very lit YouTube channel, couple channel. They very lit. They cool. They funny. They be doing challenges. They be doing pranks. They be doing all of that, y'all. Go ahead and click down there and subscribe to Monty and Shar's channel. They lit. That's all I got to say. Better go check them out. Y'all go show them some love and tell them the girl made the gym sit y'all all the time. But yes, y'all, follow up this video. Y'all better hit that bell like I just told y'all three seconds ago. Do it again and do it again and do it again and do it one more time so we can make sure that it's hit. Yes, loud. Y'all, let's do this QA. I have not been recording because I've been on the road. Um, so I'm a little bit behind. I am. I'm behind. I done recorded some stuff and didn't finish it. I did all types of stuff because I was just at home with my family. And trying to make sure I see everybody because I don't really go back home to Louisville that often. So yes, you guys, I did a lot when I went home. Got tatted, got my nails done, got my hair tattooed, did all that. But y'all will see that in a different video. But yes, y'all, let's hop into it. Let's start off with this first question. Question number one. Mm, this is my spicy question. This is my real, real spicy question. Real, 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 real spice questions. Who is your celebrity crush? Um, I'm being honest with you. I'm too grown to be crushing on some people that I don't know. I don't know you, so I don't really know how you act. I honestly, honest to God, right hand on the Bible, I pledge allegiance to the flag, all of that. I don't really have no celebrity crush. If you want to consider Derek a celebrity, I guess he's my crush, even though he gets on my nerves and he drives me crazy. Love him to death. So yeah, I guess he is my celebrity crush. Or I don't have one. If you won't take that answer, I don't have one. There you go. Do I have any siblings? Yes, I do. I have, who? I have six siblings on my dad's side, but unfortunately, I really don't talk to them. Unfortunately, unfortunately, it's very unfortunate. I don't really talk to them. If I do talk, it's gonna be one sibling that I do talk to on that side. So if you wanna be honest, I really don't be, it's gonna sound real messed up, but I don't really count them because I don't really talk to them and we don't talk to each other, so. And I'm about to hurt myself saying I got siblings out here that don't talk to me. I have six siblings on my dad's side. And I have three siblings on my mom's side. I'm really close to them. Love them dearly. Love them to death. I'll squeeze them and I'll punch them at the same time. Period. I have one brother and two sisters. My dad has all girls. So six, them six siblings, all females. What is your type? What do you look for in a guy? Well, if you want to be honest, since y'all want to know. He's got to be smart. He's got to be intelligent. And he has to have a piece of consciences. Like, if you sleep and you not walk out here, I'm really not going to be able to deal with you. I don't know. Like, some people just don't be conscious enough for me. Like, I need you to be well aware of everything that you're doing, saying, acting, all of that. I need to know, like, that you are aware of it. Like, you have to. Like, you just have to be. Why am I talking so much with my hands? That's pretty annoying. I don't know why I'm doing it, but I'm just going to do it anyways. Because it's probably because I got my nails done, if you want to be honest. But, hey, it is what it is. We all do it. You do it. She do it. He do it. We do it. But, yes, I really need you to be smart considerate understanding and all of that honesty and loyalty is my very first thing like you gotta have that girl shut your serious the police like i say i like them all 
it really is your character but i'm not gonna say i just you gotta be nice looking i'm not gonna say i just like ugly guys like you gotta be appealing to my eye but you also have to be appealing to my brain and all other stuff too and all of that like you you can't just be looking good and you lacking all the other stuff like you gotta have it all i'm just playing there's no way everybody's gonna have it all but hey the stuff that i said is what's needed for me to rock with you in the long run would i ever date a girl i have not ever i haven't ever dated a girl but would i um i don't be knowing because like honestly i feel like if i was to date a female i feel like it'd be more frustrating because like if you play with me sis you should understand because you're a female too if you're out here cheating on me sis i could beat you up like we could screw up right now and if your attitude's bad i feel like that's not gonna be good for me so two girls with a bad attitude in a relationship is not gonna work i'm not saying i have a bad attitude but like i wouldn't want to date a girl that feels like she can walk all over me and like I don't know. I feel like if I was dating a female, I wouldn't want the female to be more dominant than I am. Like, it would have to be mutual dominancy. Because I'm not about to deal with you yelling at me and raise your voice to me and all of that. And we both females. Like, I'm going, you know what I mean? It's just weird. If you get what I'm trying to say, then you understand. But honestly, I just, I don't know. Females be cute. I mean, they be cute as fuck. Like, I'd be like, damn, girl, let me kiss you in the mouth. Technology in the mouth. But I've never dated a girl. Would I? I don't know. I don't know. Females are beautiful to me, but I don't know if I would actually date one because I feel like, ooh, that would be a lot for me personally. Because I could, I could barely deal with a guy. I might just need an alien. I'm just playing. Let me stop. I don't want an alien. What is one thing you regret? I don't regret a lot. I don't. I really don't. If I can say one thing I regret about me personally is that I wish that I would have spoke up on a lot of the things that I experienced and went through. And I wish that I had more of a voice. I'm not going to lie to you. Growing up, I really didn't have that independency and dominancy. Like, I didn't do none of that. Like, I didn't talk back. Like, if I got bullied, I would just get bullied and take it. I really wish that I would have spoke up for myself. And, you know, like, not been afraid to tell people how I feel. Like, because I really did feel that. I don't know why. I really, truly don't know why. But, hey, it is what it is. I don't really like to regret nothing, though. I'm growing and going each and every day so it is what it is how do you deal with haters i don't i mean it really used to bother me not too long like probably like a year or two ago it really did used to bother me because there's really some hateful people out here and you really don't know until you on social media like why are you so hateful but you got an instagram account why are you so hateful but you got a youtube account why are you like this? I don't understand. There's gonna be some people that hate you in this life, but sometimes you just gotta be like, fuck it, fuck them, fuck everything, fuck what they gotta say, all of that. You just gotta be that way. Like, and sometimes I don't like to be that way because I do catch myself caring about what people think and that's what I feel like I struggle with sometimes. But um, I just let it go. I just let it go. If anything, I don't like to express that hate towards them. I'll probably like, if somebody talks bad to me and just says some hateful stuff, I'm gonna say it at home, probably in front of Derek. Like, I'll probably respond and be like, they messed up and forget them and this and that and that. But I don't like to spread that hate to them. Like, I don't wanna be like that because I just don't wanna be like that. I really don't. Are you going to marry Derek? Um, I pray that if I do marry somebody, it is Derek. Um, but as of now, we're not looking to get married. We're not looking for marriage. We're not looking for no kids. None of that. None of that. None of that right now. We just don't want to put that right now. Um, honestly, we feel like we just need to grow individually and like just get it together before we try to get married or anything. We don't want to rush into that because when you rush into it, you tend to make the mistakes and stuff like that. You tend to overlook some things that needs to be looked at, if you know what I mean. Oh, you don't play too much. What is your body count? I'm not answering that because guess what? I don't have to give y'all an answer to that. I really don't. I don't have to give y'all an answer to that. That's rude. But. It's on one hand, that's all you need to know. It's not five though, boo, that's what you thought you do. It's on one hand though, all right. What's your favorite color? My favorite color is baby blue, baby. I love blue, blue is such a beautiful color. Blue is such an earthly color. When I look up in the sky, I'm like, damn, that blue is ignorant. I bet you some of y'all didn't even know what that meant. That's Kentucky slang for you, Louisville slang. Louisville Kentucky slang. Justice for Breonna Taylor, y'all better stop playing. Do you want kids? Um, I will forever say this. I'm not gonna say I will forever say this. Currently, for the rest of the year, I'm feeling like I don't want no kids. So, it'll be the same answer for the rest of the year, maybe even next year too. 
Um, two years ago though, I did say I wanted kids in two years, which is now, and I don't, I don't. I was tripping. Last question, you guys. Last, last, last lit question. Have you ever cheated? And if you haven't, would you? Ooh, y'all nasty. No, I've never cheated on nobody. I mean, if you consider talking about people cheating, um, then I did that, but um, I've never cheated on nobody. I've never, um, I just don't got that type of energy in me. I got a very loving um, heart, because my mom pushed a lot of love into me, and she really showed me what love should be like. And one thing I know is when you love somebody, you don't cheat on them. You don't lie. I mean, but sometimes I feel like that's a. Sometimes you do lie to the people that you don't want to hurt. Unfortunately, that sucks. That's a terrible thing to say. But um, yeah, I've never cheated on nobody. I just don't got it in me. Like I just care too much, and it's just like I just wouldn't want to have that person all messed up because of the actions that I did. You know, that's what I would have to live with for the rest of the time that I'm dealing with them. Maybe even the rest of my life. I just, I don't know. I just don't got that in me. And so that means get to the second part. Would I ever cheat? It's a crazy question because I feel like everybody thinks about cheating. Like, if you want to be honest, like, everybody thinks about it. Everybody has an idea of it. Everybody pictures it. And, I mean, I have before. I've thought of it before. But I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to. I'm not mean. I'm nice. I'm a nice girl. So I don't want to do that. I just wouldn't. I don't know. It's too hard. It's too hard. I just don't got it in me. I just don't. I don't know why you ask me that. I don't. And why are you trying to make me? Anyways, y'all, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. This was a quick, spicy Q&A for some questions that I did not answer. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that bell if you really mess with me. Go ahead and drop some comments down below. Let me know what else you would like to see on my channel. Do you like me or do you not like me? Do you love me or do you not love me? Let me know because I really want to know because I need to. But anyways, y'all, I'm out of here. And that's on Gang of Life. Gang. Peace. <laughs>